Pichu. Hi, it's Pichu. So, you want to learn how to draw men? Or you're only here for Sukuna X Cinderella? Well, I can help with that. In this video, I'll give you advice on how to draw men using my Jujutsu Kaisen X Disney Princesses art as an example. And today we have a special collab with Parblo, a manufacturer of graphic tablets and accessories. I only recommend you drawing equipment that I'm interested in myself, so I'll be showing you how to draw men on their Intangbo X7 graphic tablet, plus a mini review. If you watch this video all the way to the end, then you might get a drop -down. Just kidding. <laughs> If you make it to the end of this video, you'll be rewarded with an Instagram giveaway where you could win an Intangbo X7 drawing tablet for yourself. I've added timestamps in the video so you can skip to parts that are helpful for you. But remember, you've got to study a bit before you get your award. Let's get started! Ta-da! This is the Intangbo X7. Can I just say how pretty this packaging is? Like, it's really making the unboxing experience Nice. I'm not sure what this is for, but I'll use it as a coaster or something. There's a little dent on the box, but I'm not really bothered by that. Now let's see what's inside. Wow. There's the graphic tablet and a need to know guide sheet with the English translation at the back. Oh my god, look, it's pink. <laughs> I ain't never seen one come in such a cute color before. Oh my gosh. I'd use this just because of how aesthetic it looks. It comes in two other colors though. What? They've also got stickers in here? Okay, okay, pause. Let me glam up my tablet real quick. The cloth for wiping your display, a glove which stops your greasy little drawing hand from smudging up your screen and reduces friction, a stylus with a case, and it's all pink. <laughs> And extra nibs for your stylus. There's a quick start guide booklet and leaflet with instructions inside, a connection cable, and finally an OTG adapter so you can connect the tablet to your mobile devices as well as your PC. Now let's set it up and start drawing! I just need to follow the instructions in the guide booklet or leaflet and it looks pretty easy to understand. So I'm connecting the graphics tablet to my Samsung Tab S6 I usually draw directly on this, but it's great that you can use the Intangbo X7 with mobile devices that don't already have stylus features built in. The setup is, yeah, it's pretty easy. Turn this switch to configure everything to your devices in an instant. Now we can actually start drawing. I'm not used to using graphic tablets without a display on them. I find it kind of strange drawing on something that isn't the screen I'm looking at, so this will be an interesting experience. Okay, this is the important part. Does it feel good to draw on? It does. I'll have to adjust to it, but the rubber nib adds some friction on the tablet when I draw, and I really like that. The buttons don't work on the Medibank app I use. It might work with other drawing apps though, like Ibis Paint, etc. But it's not really a problem for me. I can always use my other hand to zoom in and undo on my S6. The buttons work perfectly fine when connected to a PC though. And that's the Intangbo X7. I can say that this tablet is very cute. It's light and it's comfortable to use. In my opinion, it's a good starting tablet for beginner digital artists. The price isn't too bad either actually. But who knows, you could get this for free if you join my giveaway. So hang on to the end of the video, remember? Now, let me give you some advice on how to draw men. First, I need to clear something up. There's not a one rule fits all approach to drawing guys since they come in all shapes and sizes. This advice is for the average biological man because it's important to learn the basics before you can change things up a little bit. So I'd advise you to study male anatomy. If you want to improve on drawing people in general, you need to study anatomy. Anatomy is the study of plant or animal structure. To be honest, this topic needs an entire video by itself. Like, just look at this! What is that? I'd be crinkly by the time I finish explaining this. So, I'll try to make it simple for you. Pay attention to this diagram. In comparison to women, males typically have broader shoulders. Their shoulder line is the broadest part of their body. More narrow hips. Their hips are equal to or smaller than their rib cage. Men biologically are more muscular than women. Their muscles are more pronounced even when their body type is a leaner build. This is just a template though. I'll leave a link to them in the description below so you can download them later. Once you've learned the basics, you can change the proportions of the body for different body types. If you're still struggling though, it's helpful to break anatomy down into simpler shapes. 
Which brings us to form. Use simplified shapes. When drawing men, you don't have to draw every single muscle and detail to make them look like a guy. You can break things down into simple shapes instead. Doing this not only makes anatomy easier to draw, but it can also be a nice stylistic choice. Keep this in mind if you want to get better at drawing guys. Men have harsher lines and are more angular, whereas women are curvier, have softer lines and rounded shapes, subject to variation. So use more boxy shapes and straighter lines when drawing men. At the end of the day, you can get better at drawing anything if you don't. Do life drawings. Life drawings are drawings from life and I encourage you to do them when you're studying art. You can get a friend to pose for you or use images of models online as a reference. Disclaimer, make sure your safe search browser settings are on if you don't want to see some butt cheeks. Watch videos of guys moving about and interacting with the environment and sketch them out so you can understand how their body works in motion so that when you get to drawing them, you have a better understanding of what their body is like in different poses. Yay! We're almost there! Hang on until the end! Remember the giveaway! The giveaway! This is the chill part of the video. I'm going to finish this drawing on the Intangbo X7 and you can grab your own pen and draw along with me. Drawing a little bit every day will help you to improve on your skills. One, two, three, let's go!
Congratulations! You made it to the end! Now you can get the reward! Ooh! I'm co-hosting a giveaway with Parblo on Instagram to show my appreciation for your support so far. To enter the giveaway, click the link below in the description and follow the instructions on my Pablo X Pichu Instagram post. I'll be choosing the winner at random and the deadline is the 15th of June 2024. So enter while you still can! Thank you so much to my Pichu supporters on Coffee. You are the reason why I get out of bed and get motivated to make more content on YouTube. Pastel Royale GG Pixels Marching Mellow SPF Mocha Ward Paz Star Moon Exo Your Anxiety and Cowboy is Dusty Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. Now I'll return to my dungeon to make more fan fictions for y'all. <laughs> Until next time, I'm fading away now. Bye!